Miss Josie. First of all, I would just like to say that um, I like being around elderly people. And um, I grew up in Orange County, which is kind of a farm, but we are, our specialty is orange. <laughs> Basically, Christians, the Jews, the Catholics, we need to form an alliance and we need to stick together. Because if not, the world might come to an end. Why are you guys laughing? Thank you, Josie. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I am going to be bringing somebody into this community, and I do respect and value what each and every one of you think. I do have a tough decision to make. But, uh, unfortunately, I do have to let somebody go. Surprise, surprise, elimination time is happening. It's hard, it's very hard. Somebody does have to go. Sitting there, stomach in knots, really, really upset because I didn't get to really say how I felt on stage. I was mortified. If the ladies don't mind, maybe you guys could uh, head back to the bar for a little bit. Thank you very much, ladies. I don't know, if anybody has anything, I'd love to know. I mean, who's going back to the city? I think the girl with the real strong looking legs with yeah. the short jean skirt on. You want me to send Miss Lisa? Yes, sir? I ain't send nobody over. <laughs> He's gonna leave the work up to me. Send uh, Josie home. Josie? I was a little offended when she called us all elderly. <laughs> Understood. You need to send home Lisa and Josie. You want me to send two at once? <laughs> it's awesome to hear the town's opinion, but ultimately it's my decision. One of them was going back to the city. This is so stressful, oh my god. It was time for an elimination. Some gal was gonna go back to the city. I definitely appreciate all of your input. I've made my decision. And um, you've all been helpful. Thank you very much, I appreciate it. Ladies, would you guys like to come with me? Yeah. Yes. Sure. All right. Miss Krista, you're first. All righty. Luckily for me, I was immune because I won the challenge, I could not be eliminated. You can sit right up there with me. Oh, very nice. Can I get the first four ladies right here, please? All right, so what we have is a special bingo game. There's only one person who's not gonna get bingo, and I know who it is. That's the gal who's going back to the city. I was really scared because I still feel like there's a little bit of a wall and I don't know if it's that he's not interested. So I thought I had a good chance of being on the chopping block. All right, ladies. All right. All right. All right. I'm going to hand them out. Miss Kenesha. Yes. Miss Lisa. There's your card. Miss Brooke. Everybody ready? Yes. Bingo time. In 45. The next number is 069. Okay. I-28. The next number is B-6. I have one more on the screen, sorry. I-25. B10. Bingo! That a girl. Bingo! G46. N44. Bingo! B3. Bingo! B1. Bingo! Bingo! O75. Left. Oh, I'm left. I'm out of numbers. I'm, it's me. It has been an absolute pleasure getting to know you. I really didn't feel like you could honestly be the farmer's wife. But there are a lot more personalities in this group 
And yours is so outrageous. And I don't care what I think. I think that when a group of ladies come to visit you on a farm, it can't be cheap. You didn't go buy us flowers, you picked flowers. Sec no, you guys, I, this is what I no, think he needs talk. to okay. improve. I mean, what do you really have to offer a woman? I mean, besides hard work. <laughs> and you know, the other beauty queen, Stephanie, went first, and I'm the second beauty queen, and uh, who's ever the third beauty queen is going home. But I want a departing gift. You can't just get rid of me just like that. You have to do something nice. Can I send it to you in the mail? I'm not leaving until you bring a present. I have a friend who is waiting to take you back to the city. Thank you, Josie. Bye, Josie. <laughs> you know what, Matt? You're a great guy, but I think you're cheap, and all you do is make us work. And who wants to upgrade to your lifestyle? I'm too good for him. Ooh, it's hot. Now that that is over with, I'm going to spend some alone time with one of you tonight. One of you's going on a date. Did a little thinking on who I want to get to know better. And I think I would like to get to know Stacy. Yeah, good. <laughs> I was genuinely a little jealous. I can't help it. I, that's just the way I am. Like I don't know. It just it sucks. Stacy is this wonderful girl who has worked so hard. That's kind of why I wanted to pick her for the date. I really wanted to get to know her a lot better. Let's saddle up, get out of here. Somebody's got to get ready for a big date. I'm not leaving without my present. Friend Matthew has to give a departing gift, or else we're gonna have to call the sheriff to escort me. Out. <laughs> Josie first. Yeah. Josie! Oh. You haven't packed? No. You have I'm to sorry. pack. Oh, yeah. Josie, come on. Girl. Come on. I'm going to ask you for a refund for my shoes. I ruined two designer shoes and my watch. I'm not going home without a gift. I swear I'm not leaving without a departure here. I don't go just like that. We stayed here for a week. Well, we can't like call him and tell him. Oh, well, I guess we're going to have to call the police officer and get me escorted out here. I'll pack my bags, but I'm not leaving. Don't. I'm, I'm not leaving without a gift. I'm serious. I will okay, stay. Okay, but we're going to bring your bags okay. At least let us take your bags. So you get that. Women work, I like to see you guys working. Okay. Did Matt bring me my present? I'm not leaving. No, Call the sheriff. Jo oh, yes, I told you I'm not leaving. Joe's. 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 Nice gentleman came to get you. Are you about ready to go yet? I'm not going until I have my departing present. Well, I gotta drive you and I got things to do. Well, I'm sorry. We're trying to get her out of the house and she will not go. would not leave the house unless Matt brought her a present. Bless her heart, she is insane. Why are you guys so mad if he brings me a present? Why does it bother you guys? His cousin is still here waiting. Okay, we'll have his cousin. So, no, listen, he's not coming. Call, call, call Matt on the cell phone, go. Oh boy. Well, y'all work it out. Keep right. your shirt up. Bye, bye. bye girls, I'll miss you. Jojo. Ciao. Here's Matt, no. he's on no. speakerphone. I'm surprised he has a cell phone. Hello, Josie. What are you doing? Aren't you on your way to the airport? Uh, no. You promised a departing gift. Uh, actually, at the present time, I'm not going to be able to give it to you because I have an. I don't care about your excuses, like really excuses or excuses. That, uh, you get you your ass in your car and you bring me a gift like you promised, and I'm not going anywhere. Matt, can I have your phone? Oh, Matt, wow. don't hang up on me. I have your phone number. I'll call 150 times or 500 times. Josie, I love to sit here and argue with you, but I have to go. I have a date to get ready for, and I'm very Well, enjoy about getting it. ready for your date, I'm... and I guess I'll see you soon. He said he's on his way. Still here. She won't leave without a gift. So 
Okay, this is how I'll leave. I'm going home without a gift. I waited around and finally I ended up leaving because I think he's a cheap bastard and there was no gift. I I'm bitter towards Matt. He just wants a woman to work. Matt, what a bastard, yeah. Bastard.